Um, I, I, I started off with Silent University um, because I was very interested in the way it was going to explore silence as a um, protest, uh, as, a, as a tool for protest, uh, but in a very positive way, the positive um, connotations of silence. Um, um, that was before I even knew that um, it was going to be about education and it was going to be about refugee activism. Uh, uh, even the silence itself was purely um, as a... I, my background is in um, performance and that was very interesting for me. Um, as I became more involved in it, uh, what kept my interest was the very fact of uh, lots of people from different backgrounds um, with sometimes very little in common uh, kept turning up um, to meetings, to um, events that were organized, uh, uh, and yet some, somehow the content of those events was very fluid. Um, we weren't often sure what Silent University was. Um, I can actually say I'm still sometimes not sure what Silent University is, but we are still all coming. Um, and I think that's a very kind of human network that it's created um, um, that's trying to discover its own kind of common points uh, with each other. Um, recently I have become more involved because Ahmed has asked me to uh, be part of either conferences or uh, uh, represent uh, somehow into university in, in conferences that are related in subjects such as uh, voice um, or, um, or similar um, situations. And uh, the fascinating thing that I think that for me has kept uh, coming back is we are still turning up sometimes outside of London a few flights away and uh, the, the network reassembles, the content is completely different, the context is completely different, and we need to think about some new things as well to bring in. Um, it's, a, it's a point where a lot of things are happening and connections are being made, and I think very deliberately and very uh, cleverly, Ahmed is still um, is resisting setting things in stone about Silent University because he's resisting the imposition of uh, the kind of the artist's view on top of all, all of this. Uh, um, and that has come back every time I, I go to a new place to talk about Silent University or take part in a, um, in a um, conference. Uh, um, and I think it's, it's, it's very apt that it's come back again because it happens even in the smallest meeting that we have with a group of other consultants or uh, some of the lecturers and then in, in such big contexts too.